Hello, everybody. So, I... This is the first video um, I don't on play Fortnite a often. computer. So, I'm going to teach you how to get macros for Fortnite. If you have a Steel Series device, in which my case I have a Steel Series keyboard, I'm gonna teach you how to get macros. Okay, so first thing you need to do is pull up Steel Series. It keeps appearing on my other monitor. On you need to put you need to if you like you if you already have the Steel Series device. If you don't have the Steel Series GG launcher, then you're gonna need that. You need to download that and go to the profile for your device if it's a keyboard or not. And so like I said, mine's in this case the keyboard. You're gonna want to go to the macro editor. Now I already have the macro set up, but it really depends on how your keybinds are. So my keybinds are. So I don't play on PC as a controller, so I'm terrible at this. I just wanted to use this computer. So my keybinds for editing. And so in that case, go back to Skill Series Macro Editor. What I would do is I'd click G like this. I'm gonna show you guys. You click G, let go of G, and then press your mouse button. Then press stop. Press settings, and I set it to no delay because, well, there's if you want it to be smooth, then no delay. And then press save. Then you can exit the macro editor. Go back to your keyboard layout here. I'm just gonna scroll to the side. Because in my case, I wanted this zero key to be the macro, so you're gonna click that. It's going to show this. You're gonna press here, go down, and it'll say macros here. You just press this. I already have it activated, so it's not gonna let me do it again, but you click this, and then press this. I press toggle auto repeat. I'm not sure why toggle hold isn't on, but auto repeat. And press, um, you would want to set this to zero. And press done. And then save down here. Once you press save, you're going to go back and test it up. Test it up. So I'm going to click the zero key. It works. So yeah. All right. It's pretty easy to do that. Like I said, it all depends on your keybinds. So if you have like different keybinds, you're gonna have to like change it up differently. It just really depends. But that's it. That's all. But if you want another <laughs> video soon, then there'll be another video soon. So no intro because I literally just started making these videos. I'm using Streamlabs. Um. No, I'm not st not Streamlabs. I got that. I'm using OBS Studio. So, yeah, I'm gonna show you guys. I'm using OBS. See, and so I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.